Hello and welcome to Through the Woods. Through the Woods is a third person Norse horror adventure and it is set in a forest at the western shores of Norway and it tells the story of a mother and her missing son. It's made by a Norwegian uh, game company called Antagonist and it is uh, based in Oslo and was founded in 2014. This game is from uh, November 2016. I have been playing it before but I wanted to make a bit of a showcase video so you can get a bit of an idea what this is all about. Now I can select a previous save so we'll start off with the first chapter of this game and I'll walk you through that. This game is uh, made uh, uh, with the Unity engine and at the moment it's only available for PC. Uh, it is, does not seem very likely that it will come to consoles like the Xbox because uh, the company is only consisting of five developers. Now as you can see this is uh, situated in uh, a coastal area in, uh, in Norway, actually this is uh, on a lake. And the, uh, these are the two main characters. I'm gonna go exploring mom, okay? Okay, just keep away from the pier, it's old. I will. No. We, here we meet uh, the first uh, main character, it's Espen, and the other person was his mom. As you can hear, uh, he speaks English, but he can also speak Norwegian. And there is a various uh, di different uh, ways of choosing the subtitles. There is uh, English and several other languages. For now I set it to English. You can play this game with uh, keyboard and mouse, but also with the controller. I'm using the controller here. As you can see, it can also uh, run. You cannot jump. Now, this is the, the pier her mother was talking about, of his mother. <laughs> he shouldn't be going there. But, because Esben is a naughty boy, he's still going to visit the pier. Okay, coming. Now Esben likes a pizza, but he still wants to check out the pier. As you can see, I think it's pretty well made. I've been to Norway myself and I don't think it looks that dissimilar. Now then, as mother was talking about the pizza, let's go and get the pizza. Now this is the holiday home, nice place, I wouldn't mind staying here myself. Now remember this is a horror game so this starts out pretty calm and quiet and nothing seems to happen but it is a horror game and it I don't know if you are a mother and you are having children yourself it might be advisable not to play this game mom hey mom wake up mm. wake up you've been asleep all day okay it's been I'm up <coughs> sorry why do you have to stay up so late you're always tired it's been I came here to work you were supposed to be with your grandparents this weekend. <sighs> Sorry. Just let me get some coffee. We'll go night fishing down by the lake or something. 
I just wanted to go to the bathroom, but it's dark outside. I'm sorry. Go get the flashlight and I'll come out with you. Look at the stars, Espen. Well, this is pretty well made. I'm a sky watcher myself, so I know the stars above are pretty damn correct. I can't point you out any well-known constellations through the trees, but trust me, it's very realistic. You coming? I thought you had to go. I do, just a sec. <laughs> I'm here, mom. <laughs> you wait right here, won't you? Of course. So, what do you want to do tonight? Mom, I'm trying to pee here! <laughs> we could make some hot chocolate. Mom! Go away! Just wait up the path! I can't go while you're standing there! Okay, little man. If you say so. Are you done in there, Espen? Espen? Stop messing around, Espen. I'm not in the mood. I mean it, Espen. Come out! Jesus, Espen, what are you doing? Sorry. I thought I'd see if I could scare you after all. You were getting there. Let's go inside. I don't know if I want to make you hot chocolate anymore. I was only kidding. I'm sorry. Please, can we have hot chocolate? Okay. But don't scare me again. And you're washing the cups. Okay. Hey, can I go down to the pier in the morning? I want to try to catch some crabs. I'm pretty sure you're not going to find any crabs. It's a freshwater lake. Anyway, the pier is broken and dangerous. Please don't go down there by yourself. Fine. But I still want hot chocolate. I'm not going to pretend that I was a great mother. When Espen was born, I found, to my surprise, I felt nothing. My nightmare had come true, and I was left raising a child I didn't love. My friends became distant, and Espen's father and I began to fight. I resented them both, and one day Espen and me were alone. But as Espen got older, I slowly began to realize something. I did love him. I loved him so much I ached. He became my best friend, my favorite thing, and I lost him. We lost each other, and I don't know if I can forgive myself or Espen. Espen, why didn't you wake me up? Espen, want some breakfast or lunch? We have eggs and bacon. Guess it's out playing.
Now there is lots of notes you can read here. I'm not going to do that. You can do that on your own if you want to or I just want to show you a little bit of the place here. This is Esben's room. I loved our room at the cabin. Espen's reflectors looked nice in the sunlight, and his drawings fascinated me. He soaked up the world, and it bled from his imagination to the page, in pastels and pen. The process always seemed to distill the harsh world into something purer. But the big question is, where is Esben at the moment? He does not seem to be in the house. You can't open these doors. No, you can't. So we have to go and look outside for Esben. Esben! Ooh, it's freezing. What is he doing out in this cold? Esben? I hope you're not down on the pier. I told you that thing's dangerous. Espen, talk to me, little man. Hey! Hey! Get away from my son! Jesus! Jesus! Espen, get away from him! Espen, I'm coming! That was the first chapter of Through the Woods and it's going to get more and more interesting. Um, I just uh, want to stop at this point. So I think you got a bit of an idea where this is going. We are going to have to find Espen now and uh, this is going to be quite a bit of an adventure. Uh, and this is one of those games that really make the hairs of my back stand up when I play it. And that doesn't happen very often, but this game really, really can scare you. Okay, hope you liked it. And uh, maybe you consider uh, having a look at this game. As I said, at the moment it's only available on PC. You can get it on Steam and you get it on GOG, good old games. I will leave links in the description below. Thanks for watching, have a nice day, bye.